So in the last tutorial we created some pagination for our post list and what would be good here is let's say if I click next we have to wait let's say a second and we don't know what's going on and then the post load. So in this quick tutorial I'm just going to show you very quickly how you can make a kind of a loading screen while uh, your posts from the other page are being loaded so that the user of your application knows exactly what's going on. So like with any other video in this series uh, the CSS is already written but I'm going to show you the HTML that we are going to be using and also the CSS. So first of all we are going to create a div uh, with a class of loading overlay okay and then in that div I'm going to create another div with the class of loading you can of course put some animated gif in here or you can animate something with CSS whatever you want but we're going to be keeping it simple in this video so I'm going to just write loading and that should be it uh, so I put this div uh, at the beginning of the template called post list template uh, but it doesn't really matter where you put it because it's going to be a fixed div that is going to be spread out across all the page so I'm just going to save this uh, let's just check it out okay so as you can see we have this uh, we have this overlay right here and then we have this loading uh, block or box whatever you want to call it so the CSS for this is in the home page that CSS are around line 266 so we are using the sta same styles for loading overlay as we are using for the overlay div and for loading I'm just using in a box uh, with a width of 300 pixels it's a fixed position there are some uh, font styles and so on so now that we got uh, this div covered right here let's just create a logic uh, for this to show up only when our posts are loading first of all in our app.js file let's just initialize this loading variable okay and then since all the posts are loaded via this get post function we should define it right here so we're going to say this set so before the posts are loaded we're just going to set this loading variable to be true okay so uh, when the posts are loading we should display our loading screen and after the posts are loaded which is right here so we get the response we set the posts and right here we can just say this set loading to false and save it so if we go right here refresh the page nothing would happen we would still be just getting this loading screen right here because we didn't define uh, that condition in our HTML so we just go right here and do V if loading and that's it so uh, once the, the when the loading variable is true show this div and once the variable loading is false then hide this div so if we go to our page right now refresh it so now it's loading and once it's loaded the loading screen disappears and also since we are using get posts method to go to another page in our post list if I click next we get the loading screen and then we get uh, our posts so this works also if we go to the previous post we should be getting the same thing as I said before instead of just this loading text you can use uh, animated gif or you can do something with CSS3 animations and animate something while the content is loading so as you can see this is a very easy way to create your loaders 
Okay guys, so this is uh, this has been it for this quick video. If you like the video, please like it. If you uh, like the channel, subscribe to it. Also remember everything we did here will be available for you on uh, GitHub. Uh, you can also follow me on Twitter or on Facebook, ask me questions, uh, whatever you want. So thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next video.